cows drink milk, you know. Cows, they, do they, do they, do they drink milk? milk. They you, produce usually milk. because of the slick, you're, you're confused to say milk. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> So that's the other side here on the show. We're just going to make a fun pack for you. So just stick and stay with us. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Hello there, and welcome to Family Fun Time Game Show. Game. those crimes so we want to look at that that's a good one yeah. yeah then we are looking at road safety management in Ghana you mm. know we lost a friend a couple of weeks ago so we are still on the roads the mm. roads have to be safe for us to move on it then we have features then we come to your turn yeah time out as we did every Friday um today we'll be looking at the we'll take you to the boys center where there's uh, we we saw the Anansi story a beautiful um, um, theoretical performance there and then we're going to see some poetry nights that happen at the National Theatre and then we'll take you to Tabora where there was a youth celebration beautiful program and then I'm going to take you to um, there's this lady from the she's she's an Ewe based in the US Aziza mm -hmm. she's in town and we caught up with her um, very beautiful uh, musician there and I have some cultural tips for you and I'll take you to Osu um, I call them the pride of Osu they're called the joyful heart choral when you say a bit of them I want to see we discovered something nice at Jamestown over the weekend. Mm. You should see it. Some hideouts, beautiful place, and you're going to see that at Jamestown. And then you don't have to miss the entertainment of the day. Okay. That's I like it. the poetry part because I really love poetry. You love poetry? Yeah, yeah. I used to play with some lines a couple of years ago. Oh, okay. Like the beautiful sun that rises. I look beyond your reach. <laughs> you should write them. <laughs> you should write them. <laughs> yeah. You know, uh, was it, was it on, on, on Wednesday or, or Tuesday? I tried something with faith. Mm -hmm. like I think I saw it. Uh, let, me well, let me try that with you. <laughs> okay. I mean, say slick three times. Sleek. Mm -hmm. Sleek. Sleek. Cows drink. Cows drink. No, I mean, say slick three times. Sleek. 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 Then answer the next question. Cows drink what? <laughs> I didn't get that. Cows drink what? Cows drink what? Uh, what do they drink? You don't know. Okay. <laughs> <Let's move. laughs> so so the whole idea the is that usually when you say slick, 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 cows drink milk, you know. Cows, they, do they, do they, do they drink milk? milk. They you, produce usually milk. because of the slick, you're, you're confused to say milk. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> 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 so that's the other side here on the show. We're just going to make a fun pack for you. So just stick and stay with us. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Hello there, and welcome to Family Fun Time Game Show. What time do you go to bed? Wow. Wow. Yeah. wow. <laughs> what will Irene want to be in future? I know. That's wrong. Irene wants to be a teacher. Oh. Oh. Texting FFT, your name and location to 1736. Advancing Africa. For further details, visit www.afapr.org. Africa, it's time to find your goals. Supported by. 
Hi, my name is Kafri Day, and you're welcome to Energy Hour. This is the show designed to put the hard-hitting questions to authorities in the energy sector. You also get the opportunity to ask all the pertinent questions that you've always wanted to ask about issues energy. Energy Hour is insightful, revealing, factual, and illuminating. Join the discussion on our Twitter handle at EnergyHourGH and on Facebook.com forward slash EnergyHourGH. Energy Hour, getting the answers you deserve for the energy you need. Watch Energy Hour this and every Monday, 6 p.m. on GTV. Are you a superwoman? I have the most amazing girlfriend in the whole world. My mom is the bestest mom in the whole world. My best friend now juggles three jobs and five kids each. Superwoman, pa. Is your mother, auntie, sister, wife, or girlfriend your superwoman? Then let the world know about it. As Jandel presents the Superwoman 2014, celebrating amazing women on Mother's Day, 11th of May at the Event Haven Trade Fair featuring Cecilia Marfo, Bisa KD, Ben Bracon, El Dunamis Youth Choir. Tickets are available at the Jandel offices and Event Haven. For tickets reservation, please call 0501-339-026 or 0545-545-552. Who is your superwoman for 2014? Okay, welcome back. We start first with our first interview here on the show, and we'll be talking about unlawful arrest and detention. Uh, but into the weekend, that's how I was really talking about the weekend, how we warm up into the weekend. This weekend is going to be something so special for all of us. This is when we tend to celebrate our mothers and uh, let them know how much we love them and appreciate the good things they have done for us throughout our lives, no matter who you are, where you find yourself, or what you do. You know, GBC started this wonderful thing and promotion, my mother my story, where you bring in these wonderful stories about your mom and, and what makes her that unique. Um, we've selected some of the winners, actually we've selected winners for that promotion and we'll be celebrating this wonderful mothers at the La Palm Royal Beach Hotel this Sunday. So it's going to be something unique this Sunday. So we just stick and stay with us as we take you over to the La Palm Royal Beach this Sunday to celebrate our mothers and let them know how much we love them so much, so very much on Mother's Day this coming Sunday. So um, don't go anywhere. Let's move straight into our interview. My guest is uh, J. Upukweji, who is a legal practitioner, and we'll be talking about unlawful arrest and unlawful detention. Good morning. Good morning. I hope you're doing well this morning. I am. I don't know if you say, I don't Okay, we thank God. Now, let's uh, start on the basics. Unlawful arrest. Uh, what's unlawful arrest? Well, um, if I may look at it from the other side, I'll say arrest, which is unlawful. So Meaning? we will look at what lawful, lawful arrest, arrest is. is. Anybody at all uh, can arrest a person. Mm. A police officer can arrest, and then uh, a private person can also arrest. Uh, but